Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy SR7 and welcome back. Today we're going to be reviewing Future Stars Julian Alvarez. So as you can see, he is 5 foot 8, right footed, high high work rates with 4 star skills, 5 star weak foot. He can play in a multitude of positions such as striker, centre forward, right wing and left wing which is fantastic for squad building. Looking at his stats, he's got 90 pace with a 94 acceleration and 87 sprint speed. He's got 91 shooting with 91 positioning and finishing as well as 93 shot power. He's got 86 passing with 88 vision, 88 short passing and 90 curve. He's got 90 dribbling with 92 agility and balance as well as 90 ball control and composure. He's got 75 heading accuracy and 81 physical with 88 stamina and 90 aggression. So those are the key stats in this card, that's what should make him good. Without further ado, let's get into the gameplay, let's see how he plays and I'll give you guys my thoughts on the card at the end of the video. So getting into the first clip here, we get onto the ball with Jairzinho, played back to Pogba, we find Alvarez there, a nice little skill move to get away from the defender and he slams that ball on the weak foot across the goalkeeper into the back of the net. An absolutely fantastic finish from a very difficult position, great skill to create the chance and a phenomenal finish. Onto the ball now with Alvarez again, we spot the Ronald Walcott, play through to him and we roll it past the keeper there. Great play from Alvarez, great finish. We step up for this penalty with Julian, absolutely no mistake made, he hammers this ball into the back of the net. Fantastic goal, fantastic finish. Walcott on the ball here, he plays it across to Nakata, we do find Alvarez making the run, fantastic bit of pace here, great drop of the shoulder, gets past the defender and squares it to big boy Jezinho who taps the ball into the back of the net. Valverde on the ball here, he plays it across and we do take this down with Gareth Bale, we roll it across to the boy Julian Alvarez camping in the box for an easy finish. We are gonna go with a bit of a, well what some might call a bit of a ratty celebration but that guy was just being a complete just you know absolutely infuriating in that game so he deserved it but nonetheless we come back with Walcott here and we played back once again for the tap in. Alvarez's positioning is absolutely elite he gets into the positions all the time for the tap ins and another one here we do play to Walcott there great for the team play and Alvarez just lays it off for the onrushing Walcott before coming down here and stealing the ball from the opposition through on goal, outside foot shot, beats the keeper at the near post and a fantastic finish. Onto the ball now with Paul Pogba. We get the ball here with Alvarez, great play and unfortunately we get tackled. We win it back immediately and he does fantastic here to win a penalty. So that is a penalty for us and we do step up with Walcott and we do score the penalty. But coming right back here with Alvarez, nice play here between him and Walcott. We go for the power shot across the keeper there, fantastic finish, just a beautiful goal all round. Onto the ball now with Alvarez again. Nice skill to get this ball through to Jacinho. We don't get the pass off but we win it back pretty much immediately here with Alvarez. Good skill here to beat all the defenders and pretty much put it on a plate for Theo Walcott. Once again, just absolutely fantastic play. Onto the ball now again with Alvarez. We do lose it but we win it back immediately. Alvarez gets it back. We go for the finesse shot. Beautiful shot after cutting inside. Sending the defender one way. Going the other. Just breaking his ankles and tucking that ball into the back of the net. Onto the ball now with Julian Alvarez again, that was a great run from him to go through on goal and we do roll this into the back of the net, easy finish, calm as you like, big boy Julian Alvarez. So as you can see, we do finish this review with 7 games, 7 goals and 5 assists, that is 12 goal contributions in just 7 games from this card, in fact one game was a, uh, a rage quit right at the start, the guy just gave us, not a rage quit rather should I say, the guy gave us a win. So it rather we only actually played 6 games with this card, so 6 games, 12 goal contributions, absolutely phenomenal. So let's start with pace. His pace, honestly this guy is so rapid, he's very small, he's got high acceleration, he absolutely feels like a bullet. He runs so fast, he's got such good acceleration, he is so so quick on and off the ball. When you tap this guy through on goal, he is gone, nobody's catching him, nobody's getting near him, there is no worries there whatsoever. Looking at his shooting, my oh my, this guy's shooting is absolutely broken. You give him a chance, you give him a half chance, you give him a full chance inside the box, outside the box, left foot, right foot, finesse shot, power shot, chip shot, it doesn't matter, try what you want and this guy will succeed. Every time, 10 out of 10, he takes every chance that he gets. He is so, so good in front of goal. Clinical, 
absolutely clinical. A goal scorer is supreme, a phenomenal strikeout in this game. I mean, there's no words to describe his shooting. It is that good. And if you think his shooting is good, I mean, this guy's a striker with a passing of an absolute world-class midfielder. His passing in this game is fantastic. If you get into a position to play a pass, just let that ball fly because I can promise you, you'll put it on a plate, on a sixpence for his teammate. They won't have to break stride. They can run into that ball and a nice easy little tap in every time. This guy is fantastic. Looking at his dribbling, again, very, very, very messy. Like, he's so small, he's so agile, he's so quick. I mean, his dribbling is fantastic. His ball control is perfect. His close control is incredible. He's just got so much control over the football. It's stuck to his feet without um, using the cliche. The ball is genuinely just stuck to his feet. He's so silky. He's so smooth on the ball. His movement is fantastic. And it's just utterly brilliant. I mean, this guy is just something else in this game. He's something else in the ball. This card is just fantastic. And when it comes to physical, again, no weak link by any stretch of the imagination. This guy's got the strength. He's got the physical ability. Very stocky, very strong, just like Sergio Aguero was. And he can hold his own against pretty much anybody on this game. It is just absolutely crazy. So all in all, what do I think of this card? He is extremely pricey, coming in at 1.5 million coins, which is the one low point of the card. But other than that, I have no bad words to say about this card. Honestly, he is a phenomenal, a fantastic and incredible player on this game. Just a truly, truly special, special card to have. If you are lucky enough to be able to afford him, or even better, if you packed him, you are not going to regret it. I mean, this guy is just absolutely fantastic. I wish I could have got my hands into this card. I wish I could have packed it because I love this guy in real life and I love him in this game. He is so, so good. He just takes your team to another level. He elevates your attacking ability to another level. And honestly, just with the way he plays, he wins you games on his own. So do I give him the stamp of approval? 100%. Yes, I do. Like I said, he's a game changer. He's a game winner. And he's one that you will never regret buying if you can afford him. So what do I give him as a rating out of 10? He gets a 9.2 out of 10 which is a huge rating that's one of the better ratings that i've given on this game for the attackers that's up there among the elite players in this game and honestly this card deserves it if there's anyone that deserves it it is 100 percent him because he is so good he is so fantastic and he just 100 percent deserves his name to be up there with the greats okay so anyway guys that pretty much brings us to the end of this video hope you guys enjoyed it if you did smash that thumbs up button leave a like on this video Subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet done so already. And until next time guys, peace.